Hello my dazzling beauties, welcome back to Pink Pretty and Sparkly. Thank you so much for being with me today. So today's video is going to be short and simple, hopefully. Um, I want to show you some of the items that I bought. Um, this weekend I celebrated my second year anniversary. Yay! Wedding anniversary. Um, and so my husband took me shopping. I mean, he knows what I like, right? If you want to see what I got, just keep on watching. Okay, so the first place that I went was Sephora. And this one was in my car for a while. This is the Way Memory Mist. This is the latest thing that uh, Janatkin added to her line. Um, so this is a heat protectant. And it's supposed to help your style last longer. Okay? Um, I did use it on the weekend. Um, I did, I curled my hair. Uh, so I sprayed this on my hair before going uh, with my time iron. You know, you guys know that I, that's how I do my curls. Um, the first thing that I've noticed with this is that it didn't make my curls last. Um, I will go ahead and, uh, and keep testing this out. Um, maybe I just didn't spray it well, or I don't know. I mean, I just one of these days I'm gonna I'm gonna keep curling my hair and using this and see how I like it. But that was my first impression. I, I didn't really see that it made my curls last, but we'll see what happens later on, okay? Okay, so the next thing that I picked up is these, um, the, the Evian Water Duo. I already owned this like a while ago, and I remember that I always kept telling myself, oh, I'm gonna repurchase this, and I'm gonna repurchase this, and you know, I just will never uh, get around to get it. Um, this is just mineral water that's what it is but you know it's a little spray it's, it's a little can so you can put in your purse and carry it with you uh, sometimes like especially in the hot summer days and I have makeup on or even if I don't have makeup on I like to have this on my purse because if I feel too hot then I can just get it out and spray it on my face and then just fan it out and it'll refresh me right away like seriously um, and, I and I noticed that whenever if I, if I see that my makeup is looking, you know, like a little dull, like I see my, like if you see that your face is getting a little dry and your makeup starts looking funny, then you can spray this on top of your makeup. This is especially for your makeup actually. It says, makeup artist tip. After applying foundation, hold can about 12 inches from face and spray it in a circular motion for about two to three seconds. The fine mist evens out complexion and creates a completely natural look. Lightly spray to revive color throughout the day. I do find that it does help me. I mean, for me, I when I get hot, I start sweating a lot. Like, I get drenched in sweat and that, that's, I hate that. I completely hate that. Uh, that's something that, you know, that's just how my body is. Ever since I was little, that's how I've been. Um, that's why I don't, I don't wear makeup too much during the summer, you know. Uh, and if I have makeup, I always make sure that I have, you know, a setting spray that is a hydrating one or something that I can spray throughout the day. That way I can, you know, just feel fresh and not get too hot and, you know, sometimes I feel like I look too, um, too dry and that's why I like these ones. The last but not least purchase that I made in Sephora was the Hourglass Banish Seamless Finish Foundation Stick. Okay, I've been wanting to try this for a long, long time. Um, you see in my videos, I've, I've used the Cal Bondi Foundation, the Born This Way Foundation, and I have another one. Um, it's from Lancome as well. Um, and so I like those foundations. I, I still love them. Um, it's just that I've noticed that the color has changed. Um, I do have more of a warmer complexion right now because of the summer. And I really got tanned this, this year. Last year I wasn't that bad, but this year I really got tanned. Um, and so I was like, okay, I really need a foundation. Um, and I got a couple, but from Sephora I got the, hour, the Hourglass Foundation, which is the one in triangle shape. And on this one, I'm in the shade Sand, okay? So this is what the foundation looks like. Very luxurious. Um, you know, the packaging is really nice. 
don't know, I just can't wait to try this on my face. Uh, a little bit goes a long way. That's what I was told. They just said that you just you just need like one little swipe on the forehead, cheeks, and the chin. And then after that you can just blend it out. Okay, so now let me show you what I got in Ulta. I didn't get much, but you know, I had to use that coupon. Okay. Okay, the first thing that I have here is the Born This Way Ethereal Setting Powder. Um, I've heard a like, really good, um, I've heard a lot of good reviews about this setting powder, and I tried it at the uh, Ulta store, and it felt so silky smooth that I was like, girl, get this for me here. It is just finely melted. Uh, it feels really, really nice, and it's supposed to add luminosity to your skin as well. And look at this, it has a heart shape. Like the heart shape on it. If you can see it. Yeah, there you go. You can kind of see it now. Okay. But it says that it provides a veil of perfecting luminosity for a finish so natural that they think you were born this way. Okay. Um, and so the powders that I have are matte powders. And so I really want to try a powder that will promise me that will give me luminosity. You know, that I, that I, don't, I won't be looking like really matte. So that's why I picked this up. And I also picked up a different shade on the Born This Way foundation. I really love this foundation. I believe that it does make my it does make my skin look natural. Like it just makes it yeah, it does make it look like my own skin. Uh, this is a medium to full coverage. So if you're looking for a full coverage, you know, you, this won't be your foundation. However, you can just build it up. Um, I love this foundation. The one that I have is a shade lighter than this one, but I was already able to tell about it, so that's why I wanted to pick up my my current shade. That way, you know, if I change, if I get lighter, then I can go ahead and mix it with the other one, and it'll be okay. Mm, so yeah, so I have the setting powder and the foundation, which is I'm really excited. Um, hopefully, I'll be picking up their setting um, their setting spray pretty soon. But for now, I'm good right now with what I have. I love these two. Mm, okay, and last but not least, well, it's kind of all together. Um, I got this little mascara for free, the Roller Lash Mascara by Benefit. I really like this mascara. I love it. And so, you know, the tiny one, it's perfect for traveling. Although I usually pack my full size. I don't know why. But yeah. I have a bunch of travel size mascaras, and yet I still pack the um, the full size ones. I also picked up the NYX Glitter Primer. I've heard a, a lot of great things about this one. Um, I'm currently using the Sephora Glitter Primer and you know I don't have any complaints about that one right now probably because I don't have anything to compare it to. So that's why I picked this baby up um, because you know all of the good reviews plus you know I have something so I can compare it to something else. Um, I've know I know that this one has you know is usually like out of stock in store and online. So when I sounds like I better get it right now because I know that I won't be able to find it later on. And so this is what it looks like. Um, I also picked up one of their glitters. They have a bunch of colors. I seriously didn't know what to pick. Um, and so I just went ahead and picked up the ice, which is like just white one. Um, that way I can just pretty much pair with any shadow lightly and we'll see how, how it works. And they also have the buy one get one 50% off I think on all the NYX products. And I also got this NYX pigment. So this is the glitter and then this is a pigment. Okay, and this is uh, like a golden color, like yellowish, I don't know, but it looks really beautiful. So that's why I picked it up as well. This is the first time that I will be trying the uh, NYX glitters and pigments and all the good stuff. Oh yeah, it's like a light gold. It looks really nice. Yeah, it's just like a really nice gold pigment. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Katie, look at this color right here. Right there next to the lipstick. Okay. It is really nice. On the bottle, it doesn't look as nice as it looks, you know, just swatched out. Oh my god. That is so beautiful. The camera doesn't do it justice, honestly. That looks beautiful. Oh my god, I really have to do the tutorial using this one. It is beautiful. I'm in love. I need to get more pigments. Seriously. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Well, my Desolent Beauties, as much as I wish I had more to show you, that is it for my makeup haul. You know, just a minute haul to show you a few things that I picked up. I'm pretty good with palettes right now. I've been buying palettes. I will give you guys, um, I will be filming a palette collection video. Uh, so that one should be up soon. Hopefully this week or next week. No, more likely next week. Um, but yeah, I mean, don't worry, you'll see my, my palette collection. It's not big, but it's not small either. Um, and so I'm waiting on a few palettes that are going to come out. Can't wait for the Huda Beauty palette. The new one, the Desert, Desert Dusk or Sun Dusk or something like that. I don't know, but oh man, that palette looks beautiful. Anyways, this is all for my mini haul today. Uh, let me know if you have any of these products. Tell me how do you like them. Give me a few tips maybe on like how to apply my um, my stick shadow. This is the first stick shadow that I'm going to try. So I'm a little nervous and excited. But other than that, I mean, I just can't wait to play with this new makeup. This new things that I got. Uh, thank you so much for watching today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let me know how, how these things work for you. Uh, let me know if you want to see a tutorial using the pigment first or the glitter first or you know I can take anything. I will love to hear from you guys uh, Please subscribe if you aren't already. Don't forget to follow me on my snapchat and on my Instagram uh, Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye